Hello friends. I welcome you all to Techmite. I hope you all are doing well. You all know that, nowadays, life is nothing without technology. You all must know that technology is nothing without programming. It is almost impossible to bring a technology which does not include programming. So, we decided, along with the technology, we should also teach you about programming and programming languages. We are starting a series for programming languages tutorial. The first language of the series is C++. We will teach you the languages in animated way, and at the end we will run the code that we had written. I hope you all will enjoy the series and learn more and more about programming. Let's start with the introduction to C++. C++ is one of the most popular programming languages. It is an extension to C language and was developed by Bjarne Straustrup at Bell Labs in 1979. C++ is a general-purpose, object-oriented programming language, but is not purely object-oriented. Its features like friend and virtual violate some of the very important OOPS features, rendering this language unworthy of being called completely object-oriented. It's a middle-level language. We will tell you more about it when we will move on object-oriented programming structure. Let me tell you about the uses of C++. C++ is used to develop operating systems, browsers, games, graphical user interfaces and so on. Some popular games which are built using C++ are Counter-Strike, Football Pro, StarCraft, Master of Orion 3, and even PUBG. Almost all the popular browsers are built using C++, like Google Chrome, Mozilla Firefox, and Safari. Like browsers, most of the famous operating systems are built using C++. For example, Windows, Mac. and Linux. If we start to list down all the developments that are done using C++, then it will take so much time and will not be possible to name in a single video. That's why I told you a few popular examples, which are, I think enough to understand the power of C++. Let me tell you about some advantages of C++. It is objective-oriented. It is multi-paradigm language. It is portable. It has low-level manipulation. It offers memory management using pointers. It is compatible with C. Its syntax is similar to other programming languages. It has a large support community. Even though it is much less about C++, but that's all for today. We will see our first C++ program in next video. Till then, stay tuned. Don't forget to subscribe, like, comment and share. Also do follow us on Instagram. Link is in the description. Thanks.